Hey, I'm going to show you how to set up dual memory cards on your camera. Let's get to it. Hello, Sean from Online Creator Studio, and today I wanted to talk to you about dual memory card slots. Most modern cameras have this feature, and I'm going to show you how I have mine set up, as well as some other scenarios that you might find helpful. So the first setup, which is how I have mine set up 99% of the time, is uh, making two copies of the RAW files, and one on each memory card. That way, in the event of a memory card failure, then I have a copy of my original RAW, you know, even if one fails. Now to set this up, you want to press the menu button, go over to the uh, wrench icon, and then the first tab here, the record function card folder selection. And then you want the second record option here, and choose record to multiple. Now, go back to the main menu, go all the way to the camera icon, and the first tab, and here you can choose the image quality. I personally use compressed raw, um, but you can choose raw or compressed raw, and then you can also choose to have it write a JPEG at the same time. Uh, it's completely up to you, but uh, once you've made those settings, what that will do then is make a copy, uh, the exact same copy on the first card and the second card. So if you choose like a raw and a JPEG, it would make, uh, you'd get, have four files in the end, a raw and a JPEG on card one and a raw and a JPEG on card two, or in my case where I use the compressed raw and no JPEG, I get a compressed raw on both card one and card two. Now another way you can set this up too is you go back to the gear and change it to record separately. And what this allows you to do is actually record, let me go back here, you can choose specifically which format you want on each card. So you could have like say a RAW on card one, a JPEG on card two, and uh, this can be helpful, you know, like if you have a client that say wants a copy of the straight out of camera files, you could provide them with JPEGs since most people don't know what to do with a RAW file. Um, and it would also have the uh, whatever picture profile that you chose um, in camera um, already applied to that JPEG file. So they would have almost like an edited image, but you know, obviously not as good as uh, what you would have with a RAW file. So that's the basics of it. And uh, I think, you know, really setting up to cop make two raw copies is the best way to go in most cases, uh, unless you have some of those special circumstances. But just that way you are covered in uh, case a memory card goes bad or you go to try and insert it and then it breaks or something along those lines. Uh, if you found this content helpful, please click the subscribe button and we'll talk to you later. Bye.